Was die Tür da rein? Ja, was ist das denn? Das hätte ich nicht. Danke. Under fire, military personnel run to engage an enemy. They flood the area, taking up positions surrounding the enemy. Smoke is used to mark the area, and the unit displays a show of force. While the offenders are detained, one of the SANDF's own is hit. Medical personnel administer aid, while the rest of the unit maintains supervision of the area. But this is just an exercise. The SANDF is renewing their tactics on the borders, incorporating new vehicles into their operations. The older, slower Samuel, used by the military for decades, is being replaced with a faster, more agile Toyota Land Cruiser. Ideal for this difficult to navigate terrain on the porous borders. We failed to dominate the, the, the borderlines with the Samal 20 because they were old and they were less and they did not um, uh, uh, compatible with the dense terrain of Mozambique borders. And now that we're having the small vehicles that can go through a very small place, so we're going to dominate and we're going to be patrolling inland not only on the borderline but we'll go in. The 2015 Status A estimated the number of undocumented foreigners in South Africa was potentially as high as 1 million persons. While firefights here are sporadic, some soldiers come under fire from people making illegal crossings, often trafficking guns, drugs and sometimes people. Here in Switzerland it's mostly Dacha and undocumented uh, personnel. At the Mozambique border it's, it's stolen vehicles that are illegally crossing the border. And then we're having the contraband, that is um, the trade that is happening between uh, the RSA and the Mozambique. When I arrive there, I'm going to try to run to my left so that you can cover most of the western side. These vehicles are the latest addition to the units who have been patrolling the borders over the years and will act as a valuable resource to combating the flow of contraband across South Africa's borders, some of which is merely secured by a fence. Units around the country will continue to be bolstered by advances like these as they maintain patrols along South Africa's borders.